Hey, I'm Sean from Sprinkler Daddy, and in this video I wanted to talk about uh, drip irrigation, um, particularly for um, those of you using Blue Lock. Um, what you're going to do, um, or what you're going to notice in your in your package for uh, when you're doing uh, drip irrigation, is you're going to have a fitting like this, which is three quarter inch Blue Lock by half inch female thread uh, elbow, and you're also going to have some um, uh, just as many. Uh, half inch sediment faucets or uh, spigots or lawn service taps or whatever you want whatever you want to call them um, and the combination of these two is going to be to plug off your um, your drip um, lines so when you get to the end of your drip line because what you're going to do um, what you're doing with your drip line is you're poking a hole in the uh, three quarter inch blue lock pipe um, and inserting a quarter inch coupler running over some quarter inch tubing to your to your shrub putting your um, drip emitter in the end and make sure the barbed end, the longer barbed end of the, uh, the drip emitter goes into the tubing. The shorter end is going to be where the water comes out. If you flip those around, the water's not going to come out. Um, but at, because you're, um, it's not like a sprinkler line where you've got a sprinkler at the end of your line to, uh, to stop the water flow. Um, you've just got these emitters. What we do is use this combination um, together as a, uh, as a plug so um, during the year when your system is is going you're going to have this kind of hidden wherever you can hide it in the mulch that sort of thing um, you're going to have a hidden and closed to act as a plug um, but when you go to blow out your uh, lines in the fall um, instead of having the air having to flow out a little tiny uh, drip emitter hole um, what we're what gets you a better and faster blow is to just crank that valve open and kind of like a bleeder valve, uh, cr cr crank that open, and uh, then all your water and uh, air can come out of the come out of the end of the line. You're going to get a lot better uh, blowout at the at the end of the year and uh, reduce the risk of uh, having your sprinkler lines freeze. So um, that's what those little guys are for. Make sure you tape um, with Teflon tape the. Uh, uh, the sediment faucet when it's going into that elbow um, just to create your seal so you don't get any leaks. So um, that's what you're going to do at the end of your drip line with Blue Lock.